Oh, my name's Anne Marie. Uh, first came to see Liam be May or June 2014. Yeah, mm. I know it's a while ago. <laughs> Yeah, so I was looking for um, someone to give me some proper training to get back from uh, pelvis injury that I'd had. So I had to learn to walk and do all that again and start building up muscles again. I was thrown off a horse uh, while I was schooling it. It was a horse I knew very well, so it was um, yeah, not an expected accident. Well, I suppose the arms are the accident. <laughs> and a friend. She'd had a, a knee injury uh, and Liam had helped to get fit to go on a ski holiday. Within quite a short space of time really, when I saw how she'd recovered and managed to go skiing in this short time frame, I said, your guy's the guy I need to see. So, so that was it really. My first goal was to um, sort of walk properly, upright with good posture really. I remember saying it, I just wanted some good posture to start with. Over my life up until that point, you know, you're just doing, you don't realise how you're using your body. After my accident, I realised that I had the opportunity to start again. So that's what I really concentrate on now. I'm always doing what I do on one side, I've got to do on the other side. Yeah, no, I had looked at other gyms and spoken to a lot of other trainers who said they did rehab. But I just thought I didn't have confidence in them. You know, I just thought, yeah, you might do rehab, but I don't know if you could do it for me and for my goals. But I'd seen my friend go from, you know, crutches to coming back from a skiing holiday and saying it was great. And I thought, wow. But he was 25 miles away from where I lived at the time. So I'd, I'd have travelled to the end of the earth just to get right. So. Yeah, it just gave me confidence that I knew that you know, you'd be able to help me. So I think the difference now is I've got some proper goals. I mean, I've always been interested in keeping fit throughout my life, but I've never, the goal's always been just to get fit, which is, only takes you so far. My fitness has definitely improved. I know how to do squats and lunges properly, and that now means I can, I won't say enjoy them, but I don't dislike them like I used to, because I know how to do them. Um, and the other thing was jumping onto a box. That well, honestly was terrifying. That and it's not that high, is it? But it's not. It's only a soft box. But what a hurdle to get over that. And yeah, that was. So that was an achievement. <laughs> I think what I am now is more aware of training evenly. Um, so I notice, or, and even when I'm just dancing, um, that I can now do movements in both directions, whereas before I couldn't. But now I know it's because I've built up unhelpful body movements and, and by training and doing everything evenly, it is easier to do things both ways. I, I am a lot more mobile now actually, I can bend more easily. I was a bit like an old woman before to be honest. I bad back and stiff and you know, but a lot better, a lot better now. When I set my mind on something I'm doing it, you know. Not just being able to get back to walking, but being able to get back to do every, everything better than I could before. That's why training helps me really, because it, it, it sort of slots into that desire for me to, to, you know, to do it better and do it better and do it better. I can't remember one training session when I didn't feel better after. So. <laughs>